everyone. My name is Susan Elizabeth Reese, and my company is Joyful Possibilities. Welcome to Joyful Possibilities with Angels and Essential Oils and Sound Therapy. I have those of you who are just meeting me, which may be many of you. I'm a sound therapist. I open my mouth and these angel songs come through. I've been doing that for over 33 years. And I'm going to, I always start with some essential oils. So I'm going to put on some frankincense. Those of you that don't know what essential oils are, they, well, this one will help be a spiritual protector and uplifter. And basically they're the life of the plant. They're little, or I call them little angels in the bottle, little earth angels, because they find you when you need them and they help change your life. They help change mine. I had no health. Now I have health. I had no wealth. Now I have wealth. So I'm very, very grateful for my little angels in the bottle. The other one I'm putting on is called ba uh, Balancing Grounding Oil. And we'll put that right down on the inside curve of my feet. Okay. So now what I do is I open my mouth and an angel song comes through. I never know what it's going to be. And it is always for the highest good of all involved. So here we go. We are seeing the world is believing that it has to be so hard what's that achieving what if you just simply sat a little while with a gentle loving trusting smile and what if you could be brings about a change your world will not remain the same you'll see as you enter into new joyful joyful possibilities your world will be created a new this you'll see kaya no mayana kaya no my your world will be created a new this you'll see kaya no my so that language was called light language you might hear it called other things but i call it light language it comes in because if we try to create from our thinking mind, it is only based on the past. It's only based on what we see out there in the world. And that's not that fun. We want to enter into a realm of new joyful possibilities. We want to enter into where we're looking at the positive things and where we're headed. Things that have never been created on this planet before. We have an opportunity to create them. And it starts with our own energy. So as we meet together, I'm always going to do an angel song. I'm always going to do, I might use some cards. I might do, use some little messages with essential oils. Um, we're going to do a sound therapy activation each and every time we meet. And the light language is really just bypasses the thinking mind. Thinking mind does not get us where we want to be. We want to drop into our heart. We want to drop into working with our highest guides and angels. I always, always ask that I work with my highest guides and angels for the highest good of all. I give you my free will to co-create with us today. And what grand and glorious adventure can we have today? How much fun can we have today? What what would it take to have our, our families and our friends and the world have more fun, more joy, um, and create more joyful possibilities? in ways that just light us up. So what lights you up and gives you your greatest joy? That is the question for today. And bypass all the old thinking mind stuff. We're just clearing that away. It's limiting beliefs. It's not getting you where you want to be getting. So just for a few minutes, relax. You'll see in the meditation, I'm going to surround us with a white light of protection. I'm going to surround us with a rose light. Everything's in divine order. Everything's always working out with me. I'm going to use a violet flame to transmute all the limiting beliefs and the yuckiness out there. But taking care of your own energy every day is the very first place to start. It's where you want to, you want to look at your own energy and then you become a mirror to the world from that energy. So if things are really kind of chaotic right now, 
stop, drop into your heart, ask that you work with your highest guides and angels for the highest good of all involved and start showing up new in your own energy field, in your day, in your life, in our world. And that is how we create a world that we would love to live in. Okay, so I want to share a couple things here. I want to share, um, I allow my gifts to shine forth is a beautiful um, message here coming from talk. Uh, each day I'm going to talk a little bit about an essential oil. And this one is a beautiful one. I actually used it to get rid of wrinkles and um, someday I'll tell you how old I really am. Oh, I'll tell you now I'm 63. So I use it to get rid of wrinkles and it's a beautiful blend. But it also, when I put it into my energy field, it allows my gifts to shine forth. So the and essential oils can be used for emotions, for energy, and for 3D physical things. Like I used to be sick all the time, stress all the time, um, and I don't have any of those things anymore. So um, I'm always available to talk to anyone who'd like to talk about essential oils. There'll, there'll be information on my page here of how to get a hold of me. And I'm always, always happy to share my, my journey and how they totally changed my life and the life of others. But the message for today is, let me grab the oil here so I can put some on for us. Some of you are sensitive enough that you'll actually feel this when I put it on. So this one wants to just go on my wrists for now can breathe them in, some you put on, some you breathe, some you can take internally, but we'll talk about that, those of you who are interested in. What we're doing now is I allow my gifts to shine forth. You have a secret sauce that is ready to unfold and bless the world, right? You know you do. People will find their way to this of all the things you could be looking at right now, you found your way to here, and that is our divine assignment, our divine appointed assignment to meet to meet this way, okay? Every single person has a beautiful gift and it's not meant to stay hidden. People in my groups, I teach Joyful Enlightened Millionaires groups, Joyful Enlightened Masters groups, and coming up soon, Joyful Enlightened Miracles group, groups, classes. And those that, I, so I, I've been doing this for oh, 30, 33 years, but the last four or five years online. So I have clients all over the world. And if you're one feel called to work with me, just let me know. There's there's an app, there's an application link listed below here too. So there's no joy in hiding your light from the world. It's why you came here. It's why you chose to be here. And those of you finding your way here, you know you chose to be here on this planet to create a change, to create a ripple effect, to create some positive energy in the world. Joy comes from being seen and using your gifts in creative and meaningful ways. That's why you're here now. Please stop hiding and be brave. The world needs us now. We need to show up and shine and share our intuitive gifts, our spiritual gifts. It's what we came here for. Okay, it's time to start acting like the beautiful creature you are and shine, baby, shine. So this beautiful oil I just put on sparks your divine nature and inner truths. Open spirituality balances doubt with faith and reminds us of our innate goodness of self and the gifts that we have to share. So I can put a little bit on my eyes. All right. So I'm going to go with the angel card now. So we have an angel card. See which one wants to jump out. And it is prioritize. Where are you putting your energy? Watch where you put your energy. Metatron, focus on your highest priorities. I will help you get organized and motivated. Now with these cards, and I'll probably do two of them because this one's Raziel and this one's Metatron. Listen to how they sound so different. So Metatron will sound different than Raziel and they'll all sound so different. So um, let's just hear from Metatron. Metatron is a very, very powerful creator. Metatron is one of just a, one or two angels that have walked the planet, lived on planet Earth. Metatron is who came to me 33 years ago when I started teaching co-creating heaven on Earth classes many years ago. Uh, helped me kind of create that and get that started. So some of you, as you're prioritizing 
your and focusing on your highest priorities. It may be to bring your gifts forward. It may be to bring some programs forward to the world or do something more creative and structured to, to share and teach like I now teach all over the world, okay? Metatron, let's hear from Metatron. Here we go. We are seeing you be a little shy when your world is asking you to shine now. So we say, why? Why are you hiding? Why are you playing small when your soul wants to sing and shine and you understand you're not alone? Call on us so that you feel more at home where you are. Then you'll go far. So we are to ask to work with our highest guides and angels, give them permission on a regular basis. I never get out of bed without asking to work with my highest guides and angels for the highest good of all. And I give you my free will to co-create today. Okay, very important because we have free will blocking this um, unlimited, benevolent, beautiful angels, highest guides and angels, spiritual beings waiting to help if we ask. So today's lesson is ask. What are you asking for? And you can ask these open-ended questions like, what would it take to have more fun today than I could even ever imagine? Let it go out there to God's source universe to show you new possibilities. Okay. So that's the angel. We'll save Raziel for another day because I want to get into the activation. Um, all right. I told you I'd, I'd let you hear the difference. So Raziel, I am bringing you esoteric information and symbols and helping you understand spiritual truths. Okay. So let's hear from Raziel. Sorry, I've been doing sessions all morning. See how, see how long my voice holds up. So far, so good. Raziel. Of course, Raziel is going to start with light language because this is bypassing the thinking mind. And we are going to get activations and downloads. And I invite you to start looking for joyful things showing up in your life, uh, clear, clearing away some old patterns and looking for the fun, okay? We are seeing you understand that you are here to create a change. This is done when you are gathered with others and us we rearrange your energy to let new things be. Kayano my hana kayano ma this you'll see will be. So they so we get downloads. So in a, in my programs we work with our high skies and angels. I work with these very, very high creative beings. Um, that are able to help us like crunch time and get things done in, um, you know, a lot quicker 3D time. We kind of morph it and quantum jump and, and get things done. Uh, in examples, I had one um, person make a million dollars working with me for six months and she didn't even have $97 to put towards the first little class that she was going to take, but she took the leap of faith and she kept investing and all these miracle things happened. So we do go into the realm of miracles. Now, not everyone created that, but if you go to my website, you'll see, you know, SusanElizabethReese.com. You're going to see all kinds of different things that people have created um, all over the place. I'll just leave it at that. I'll be bringing some of them on this program, I'm sure, to share their stories. But for now, um, I want to do a little sound therapy activation. So you get to see me put in my beautiful orange headphones here. My husband got me these. <laughs> I like them. And I put them on when I do the music because it works a little bit better. And here we go. I'm going to put on a little music. And all this music is channeled and it's music given with per permission. It's from Thaddeus and it's all channeled music that I'm allowed to use and share. So here we go. Yeah, 
you can begin to feel so as we surround ourselves with the beautiful white light of new possibilities and a rose light that's going to allow our thinking mind to just relax and a violet flame to transmute all old limiting negative beliefs take them out of your energy field take them out of our world and transmute and throw them down to mother earth She'll use it like liquid fertilizer and allow a beautiful new plant to come up. So first we wanna get you grounded, connected and protected. So as we surround ourselves with a white light, a rose light and a violet light, we ask that we work with our highest guides and angels only for the highest good of all. We give you our free will to co-create with us today. We're gonna to take an elevator, take your body down, down, down to the core of mother earth and sit on the core of mother earth. Give yourself a gentle little rocking, gentle little hug. Now I want you to feel your feet like roots going all the way down to the core of underneath Mother Earth, to the Earth Star and connecting deeply to the Earth Star. And then you're gonna receive an activation of energy coming up your feet, connecting to the Earth Star, coming up into your body, planted on the core of Mother Earth. Now you can begin to stand up and come up up as the energy comes up through your body, up through your energy, up so you feel like you have angel wings about ready to fly. And we connect to our source saying, a source, our God, our highest guides and angels, source energy, big, beautiful ball of light. And this ball of light is sending a golden energy down into our crown chakra, cocooning us like an egg over your head, broken cocooning us, golden light down to your heart. Mother Earth is sending a liquid emerald green light up, up, up to your heart. And your angel wings are open. You are now ready to go and be a joyful contribution to the world. Show up with more love and joy than you can even ever imagine. And how's get better than that? Have a wonderful, joyful, abundant day. Until we meet again, always know that I... Adore you.